Enter, let's go. Let's enter the Baden Theater. I love oh. how you don't even introduce me. <laughs> I'm just a random voice on your screen. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, hey guys. Did I? <laughs> hey guys. <laughs> this is Lola. I don't know. I don't know if it's you. <laughs> it's your channel. I don't normally do intros, but Alpha. Yeah, do it. But, <laughs> just think that I'm in your video but, talking. But Alpha here <laughs> needs me to do one to introduce her in this video. <laughs> Hi, everybody. I'm Alpha Siri. You know me as my channel, Howling Alpha. Get it. Insert my little. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, I'm happy to be here and I'm super excited to see what this game is about. Hopefully Lola Crash and Burns. So <laughs> it is go ahead, Lola. It is called Bad in Theater. I think we're gonna crash and burn a lot. Excellent. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm cutting out your promo for <laughs> uh, uh, my heart. <laughs> Welcome to Bad in Theater. <laughs> On this stage, we shall be toying with fate. To begin the tutorial, select wh whichever doll you like. Which doll do you like? The devil. You are demon doll, human doll, demon doll, okay. You control the demon doll. You're a fierce looking guy, just minding your own business. How will you interact with the human doll? Eat him. Uh, attack it? Ah, uh, <laughs> yes. <laughs> Consume his soul. You kill the human doll in cold blood. How ruthless. <laughs> you found your very first bad ending, but don't worry, the story need the story need not end here. Let's reset the stage and try again. This time, try controlling the other doll. Demon doll, demon doll, demon doll. Go ahead and try <laughs> playing as the human doll this time. I wonder, I wonder if he gets mad like uh, the terrible. Go ahead and try playing as the human doll this time. Ah, dang, he, he has nothing. Aww. Dang, I wish he could, like, force you to, like, only have, like, the spotlight on the human. <laughs> that would be funny if uh, <laughs> there's an achievement for that. <laughs> <laughs> you control the human, though. You're a friendly little guy just minding your own business. How will you interact with the demon, doll? Attack your play nice. <laughs> Attack it. <laughs> Oh! <gasps> oh! Why are we both dead? <laughs> we both attack each other at once and achieve the worst possible outcome. <laughs> oh, because we we clicked attack the human as a demon, so the demon by by default. Fault, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> that's cool. I like this game. <laughs> what an excellent bad ending. <laughs> <laughs> Made possible by yours truly. You'll do well in this theater. Now that you know how the story goes, you can set the doll's behavior in advance. As you just saw, these behaviors will automatically be set to what you choose during your last playthrough. Oh, oh gosh. So, so whatever doll we pick and whatever actions we do, we'll, if when we pick a different doll, those actions that, will still remain. Yeah. For, oh, that's so cool. But now... <laughs> you can turn each one on or off without having to replay from that doll's perspective. Yes, my theater actually doubles as a puzzle game. Oh gosh. <laughs> <laughs> now, try turning the doll's behaviors on and off to see the different outcomes. Is it- does the text glitch like that? Or are you doing something? What do you mean glitch like that? Okay, so which one do you want to turn off? Hostile um... human, hostile demon. Uh, hostile demon. Okay, turn that off. Okay, so uh, we're human. Control human. Blah blah blah. You, how we interact? Attack it still. Play nice. Let's see if he hugs it. Ah, he cute. The demon doll are able to set aside your differences and become That's friends. That's literally <laughs> me and Lola right now. <laughs> I'm the demon, and he's a little human. <laughs> oh, come on. End tutorial. <laughs> you know it. On my fire from my last playthrough, <laughs> I'm the devil. <laughs> I do some pretty chaotic stuff too. <laughs> do you oh, understand? I can't wait. Ooh. Oh, 
only have two little characters. Who should we pick? <laughs> uh, let's do the little blue demon guy. He looks kind of The cool. underling. Yes. You are a demon underling in service of the overlord. You aren't particularly strong, but not particularly weak either. That's what your friends tell you. Your jobs? Your job is to guard the castle and keep humans away. It's unbearably boring. It looks boring. <laughs> it's just a security guard. <laughs> right? <laughs> Heroes rarely come all the way here to challenge the overlord anyway. It's a lot of standing in one place staring into nothing. Dude, I'd get so bored. <laughs> you feel like you're gonna go crazy if you don't get a break. You decide to ask the overlord for a day off. That's like an eyeball on the top of her. I know. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh, it's her third eye. Yeah. She gives you an earful about responsibility and unquestioning obedience. Dude, I'm a kid. I am a child. <laughs> <laughs> I don't get paid for this? No. <laughs> you wait for her to finish her lecture before returning to your post. What does she know about anything? <laughs> he is a kid. <laughs> Complaining like that. Who made her the boss of everyone? You complain about the overlord to your friends. That just sounds like you're asking for death. <laughs> right? <laughs> they agree that she is kind of a snob and totally deserves to be kicked off her throne. Oh, gosh. You only... They... They're instigating right now. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Their faces. They're like, he's going to die. <laughs> <laughs> you only wanted to vent your frustrations, but the conversation somehow turned into an assassination plot. Oh, gosh. <laughs> yes. You should probably steer this in a responsible direction. Let's overthrow her. Let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're, you're sick of this overlord holding you and your friends back. I feel like you're going to get everyone killed off. <laughs> Don't worry. <laughs> You agree. Well, we can always redo. <laughs> yeah, we can. <laughs> you agree that it's time for a change of management. Your friend suggests maybe you should be the new overlord. Ooh. I am Alpha. <laughs> <laughs> you like the sound of that. You announce your first act of rebellion is to take that day off you like you want. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like this kid, all he really wants is just to be a kid. And when he gets, if he does at the end kill and takes over and be king all the responsibilities he's probably just gonna panic <laughs> <laughs> he's probably gonna push all the responsibilities on someone else right <laughs> you just play outside all day <laughs> <laughs> your friends aren't very impressed you sure them you'll talk more about the assassination thing when you get back which satisfies them do, do they take this kid seriously <laughs> i don't think so <laughs> <laughs> You sneak out of the castle to have some fun. I, he, I didn't expect that. <laughs> right? Sneaking out before the assassination plot. Oh, nice. <laughs> the change of atmosphere excites you. You spend some time rolling around in the grass, wild and free. As you make your way along the path to a nearby human village, you encounter a maiden. That's one of the characters we could have picked. Ooh. She seems very frightened and screams for a hero to come save her. You consider your options. Ooh, gobble her up. Tell her to quit yelling. Ah, quit yelling. Shut <laughs> your trap. When the maiden realizes you're not going to hurt her, she regains her composure. Now she's talking, started talking to you like your friends or something. You don't understand humans at all. <laughs> 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 it's like boys. I don't. I don't understand girls at all. <laughs> right. When she just starts talking, you're just like in your head, you like the <laughs> Charlie Brown. Oh, I think nah, to him, nah, is, nah. I think to him, it's like she's bipolar. <laughs> she's, right? She screamed and now she's friendly. <laughs> well, she doesn't know the language, obviously. <laughs> you speak the same language, of course. See, they speak the same language. <laughs> oh, okay. Which has always confused you. Because why is there conveniently only one language in the world? <laughs> I would like to be in that world. Yeah, you communicate with anyone. <laughs> if demons and humans have independent societies, wouldn't it make sense for them to each have their own language? I'm pretty sure they do, but English or this whatever language is probably their like 
their dominant Universal. one. Yeah. <laughs> the maiden is going on and on about some kind of destiny she's trying to fulfill. Oh my gosh, we should have gobbled her up. She's talking too much. <laughs> Our characters are probably going to die of uh, boredom again. <laughs> starvation. <laughs> starvation boredom. <laughs> the bottom line, from what you gather, is that she wants you to take her to the Overlord. Oh god. Interesting. I see I see an anime way too much. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like it could be interesting besides you have nothing better to do. We still got to overthrow the overlord. <laughs> I know, right? Satisfied with your day off, you take the maiden back to the castle and present her to the overlord. Oh my gosh, it's going to be really bad. What if the maiden tells her that I was about to assassinate her? <laughs> I, oh. I don't think the maiden would know. We just told her. <laughs> did we? Yeah. How did I miss that? <laughs> I was reading it. How did I miss it? <laughs> 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 the overlord asks where you found this maiden, knowing full well that you left the castle when you weren't supposed to. Oh, I found her in the castle. <laughs> right, she walked up to the gate. What do you want me to do? Yeah. You apologize for disobeying her, but hope that the maiden is an interesting enough present that you may be forgiven. Oh, the overlord seems nice. Yeah, her eye, though. <laughs> Looks menacing. <laughs> the overlord nods and says everything's cool as long as you always listen to her from now on. Does she have like a mother? <laughs> Does she not know children? Not know children. <laughs> You're impressed <laughs> with what an easygoing boss she is. You mentioned how you can't believe you and your friends even oh, considered overthrowing her. <laughs> yeah, definitely a kid. Oh my god, why? Oh. <sighs> Oh, oh my God, that thing. <laughs> she gives you a look in, and you say, That was just a joke, of course. When, when you steal the last cookie from the cookie jar. <laughs> she smiles and dismisses you. You decide it's about time to take a nap. <laughs> oh, a nap? <laughs> I would have I would have not slept. <laughs> yeah, you gotta keep your eyes open now. Yeah. <laughs> she, she gotta murder you in your sleep. <laughs> After a few hours of sleep, few hours, you're rudely awakened by the sounds of battle. Battle? <laughs> you emerge from your room to find that a hero has slaughtered many of your friends and work associates. What a jerk. <laughs> oh, if you're telling me to change. <laughs> Avenge your fallen comrades? Why is... That just sounds like death. Why is there a skull? That has a, that has a skull, yeah. Uh, <laughs> save yourself. Save yourself. I'm going to be selfish. <laughs> hey, they got to have some bloodline to keep going. <laughs> save yourself. You look around at oh, the lifeless forms of those you've known as far back as you can remember. You feel glad to not be in their shoes. I'm sorry, Alpha. <laughs> I'll run if you get murdered. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I tell everybody if I'm being attacked by like something that's like a like a you know like a mountain lion or something, just go. Just yeah. Just yeah. Leave. yeah it, it's, Don't risk yourself because I'm obviously not gonna be able. to It's one person dying. <laughs> exactly. Oh my god, what's my software doing? Okay, it it just had a black screen on the software for a bit. <laughs> uh oh. Okay, you also feel guilty to be thinking that as you flee the castle. Until you remember your role, not as an underling, but as a demon. Okay. This kind of thing is expected of you. What, right? To die? Oh. <laughs> Maybe you'll start a new life far away from any humans or demons. What? Where you live peacefully alone in some deep dark forest somewhere. That's Deserter funny. underling end. <laughs> oh. Don't tell me every ending's gonna have like a, a bad <laughs> title like this. <laughs> like you're a deserter. You didn't die, but you did. You're you're worthless. <laughs> but he did, he was a child. Okay. He didn't have any weapons. Okay. <laughs> what was he supposed to do? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> you are a maiden. You live in a peaceful village next to a spooky demon overlord's castle. Oh, you. Yeah. <laughs> You are told that you are fated to be captured by the Overlord one day. Oh, she's supposed to be their sacrifice. Oh, God. The town sacrifice. Because you are a beautiful young girl. 
Demon overlords apparently love capturing those. Yeah, I don't know why that's a thing. Yeah, and the, but the overlord in this game is a female as well. <laughs> hey, she can both ways. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> we'll call this maiden uh, alpha. <laughs> Oh, oh god, I'm being sacrificed to a demon. Yep, because you're a beautiful young girl. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I hope that didn't sound creepy. No, no you're good. You're good. You, you, you were born creepy. Oh god. <laughs> 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 you, um, <laughs> you can't even read. No, I can't. <laughs> words, words. <laughs> you think of how you haven't heard of that actually happening to anyone, but maybe the demons just haven't been given the opportunity. Who knows? So, so the maiden is the first town sacrifice. Oh, she must be stupid. <laughs> stupid. She can't cook. She can't clean. <laughs> They, Useless trash. They just don't want her around. <laughs> trash. <laughs> oh, you are in church. You pray to your God, asking you why. You pray, girl. You pray. <laughs> asking why you have been bored into this row of maiden. Have you changed your outfit? <laughs> that would help. <laughs> learn a skill or two <laughs> right <laughs> oh. you respect the divine plan and all but you're really just curious as to what the point of it is you are impatient so she wants to die she's going i'm just gonna go <laughs> <laughs> meeting a demon actually sounds pretty gosh darn exciting oh <laughs> that's my word pretty gosh darn fun <laughs> The perfect role for you. Right? <laughs> the maiden. I didn't know she was country. <laughs> I didn't know she was country. <laughs> oh, maybe you'd understand your role better if you were to just hurry up and get captured already. <laughs> <laughs> Only if you know what the intel of capture means. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, oh man. This maiden's stupid. She left the note too. <laughs> oh, that's her suicide note, basically. <laughs> She's like, base. Y'all don't want me, demons don't want me. You leave a note and venture forth to find a demon just to, you know, see what happens. Oh. <laughs> Not long into your little adventure, a demon underling appears before you. It looks pretty scary. Shout for a hero to come save you? That's what we did before, right? That's what you automatically yeah, tried to do. The, and introduce yourself. So, which one? Uh, she was pretty gone ho of like going over there, so introduce yourself. <laughs> okay, introduce yourself. You tell the demon your name and explain that you're a maiden from the village. Oh god! Oh god! <laughs> 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 what? Oh, hold on. We did not pick that! <laughs> Starts biting a lot. How painful! <laughs> the plan of this plan of yours was completely stupid. Thank you. <laughs> you think? <laughs> Why couldn't you have been more patient? Why did you go looking for trouble? Patient for what? <laughs> you aren't angry or anything, of course. This was all your fault for trusting a demon not to devour you on sight. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> this is your punishment for questioning fate, you guess? <laughs> bit, by <laughs> <laughs> bit by bit, <laughs> you are swallowed by the demon until you are no more. <laughs> <laughs> I was not expecting that. Consumed maiden ending. <laughs> maybe, maybe when you actually look, it resets everything. <laughs> oh my, my guess. God. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. So uh, that was surprising, wasn't it? Oh, <laughs> All right. So we're going to end it here. Thank, oh. you. Thank you so much, guys, for joining me. And 
thank you alpha for joining me on oh, in this anytime. game anytime <laughs> i can't wait to, i can't wait to do this again <laughs> and no matter what your time zone may be guys have a good morning afternoon evening bye bye bye